I, I'm going to try to do this as quick as I possibly can. If you're new to the channel, I don't script videos. Just save your comments. I don't care. Um, but I, I'm going to tell you how to make money in this industry um, just in a little bit here. But it's pretty simple and straightforward. And listen, if you want to pay me that $100, $200, that's fine. Send it to me. I'm, I'll be happy to take it. But I'm going to give it to you for free. You know, all these companies are out there saying, you know, Mary made $5,000 in bookings in one day and, and Joe did $100,000 last month in portrait photos. This is, you have to realize that um, the get rich schemes have, have bled into photography for quite a while. Um, and, you know, these programs of, of you know, we're just going to help you, you know, guide you to make this much money in photography is a little delusional, just like it is for everything else, you know, whether it be online marketing or, you know, affiliate marketing. Yes, money can be made in all these industries if you follow the steps and do the work. The do the work part is the, the pe thing people miss. Um, you know, for someone to tell you that you have to get clients, market to clients, but we're going to give you that special script, to make them dive to your studio. It doesn't exist. I'm sorry. I don't give a shit what you say unless you say, come to my studio. I will shoot you and give you a thousand dollars. Then they're going to go in droves. Otherwise it's not there. Okay. Um, the only way to get business today. Now I'm not saying that Instagram is a bad thing. Uh, you should be on Instagram. You should be seen, uh, Facebook, same thing. But the only way to get business is, is to do the work. Now let, let's just cover this really quickly because right now most photographers are, oh, I have to post an Instagram, I have to get the likes and then I'll get business and they're just going to knock on my door. It doesn't work that way. Instagram is, you know, we're geared into swipe. I don't care if it's an ad or a photo that people love. Even if you love the photo, click, click, swipe. You know, think about the last photo that like stuck in your head that you saw on Instagram and like loved and you tapped twice because you, you know, wanted to show appreciation. And then you kept swiping. But who was that photo taken by? 90% of the time, you don't know who the hell it was taken by. Because it's not, it's not set up that way. It's not set up to go, oh, wow, let me read the description. Okay, now let me go to the photographer who took this because I really like this. We, we don't do that. You know, we're in an instant world. We just keep swiping. You know, we want to see as much as we possibly can in the short amount of time that we possibly can. It's entertainment, it's visual excitement, whatever you call it. That's what it's set up for. Okay. And sending someone to your Instagram account to see your portfolio, you know, great. It's not what is going to bring you business. Yes, you will get some business from Instagram. So don't come at me. But, you know, it's funny, like I do marketing for a, a couple companies. And let's use one in particular, the salon. You know, they're young stylists. And their biggest bitch always, because they're young and I'm old, is that Instagram is the way to go. So if I use Instagram and I get likes and I get followers, I'll get more business. And I say, well, I push through Google and that's the way I get more business. And they say, that's because you're old. That's old fashioned. You know, you have to be on social media. That's what works. At the end of it, every single one of these conversations where I just can't convince them that they're wrong and I'm right, I always say, listen, I'm really hungry. I don't have my phone. Could you find a place? I'm, I'm, like, I'm hungry for seafood or I'm hungry for burgers. Could you find me a, like a local place for seafood or burgers? 100% of the time, they pull up Google and they search for what I'm looking for on Google and then show me the results. And I always say, wouldn't that have been easier with Instagram? Point taken. They still don't believe me. But they're themselves, this is what they do. Now, Google is one point, and, and I've made that point before in other videos, but getting out there and talking to people and shaking hands and handing a business card is where you're going to get your business from. You need to get off your ass and work the business. Posting on Instagram and getting likes is not going to make people knock at your door. And uh, so many photographers, that's what they wait for. They expect, wow, like I got a thousand likes in this photo. I'm going to get a phone call soon. <laughs> it, it doesn't work that way. Um, you know, I shoot benefits and, 
you know, money making events like, you know, the charity work all the time. I do, you know, the library and a couple other things, but I'm in front of people, you know, for group shots, for events, and then I shoot the event itself. Like I'll shoot um, a library event and there'll be 500 people there. I will take as many photos as I possibly can. I will upload them to my site and I will send the link out and every single one of them gets it. And I tell them, you download and use those photos for whatever you like, they're absolutely free. Photographers go nuts over this. Like what the hell's wrong with you? But without spending a dime in advertising, just some time in an event, I'm getting people to see my work, to go to my website, to know who I am. And I get so much business from that, from headshots to family photos to, and I don't do many family photos, but I do them. Um, I get so much business from that because they met me in person. They see how I work, they saw, see my work, and they see what I've done. And I was charitable into the event. It brings me work. When they come into the studio, I treat them like gold. I make sure they have a great experience, and then they show their friends. And word of mouth advertising is everything in this business. That's where you're gonna make your money. Now, these programs that are charging $129.95 and three payments of $250 and, oh my God, so many other things. And, you know, I know it seems like you're doing something because you're buying into this, but most people buy into it and go, okay, yeah, I'm gonna do this. And then still post on Instagram and wait for nothing to happen. You know, that's a money-making scheme just like every other one. <laughs> And, and, you know, for those of you who do these, don't come after me because, yeah, anything will work if you follow a thing, but, you know, it's not, not in your interest. Your interest is sell the program. Uh, you give a shit whether a photographer makes money. You want like 10 of them to make money and for it to work for because you need the, the great reviews. <laughs> but I'm sorry. Like, get out there and work it. That's the way to do this. Um, that's why this video is out there. Now, listen, you know, I just gave you the secret to success. You can get off your ass and work it um, and meet people and hand them your business card. Yeah, business cards still work. Um, you know, do, and don't share your Instagram feed with them when you meet them. Put your Instagram feed on your card. Give them your card. <laughs> They need something in their hands. They need physical. They need something to go, hey, you know what? I really liked him when I met him. Let me call him because I know this photographer that works. I have his card. That works. I'm sorry, but like when you can them your Instagram feed and go, oh, just follow me on Instagram and you know, we can get together and we can shoot. You know, no. <laughs> One week from that day, well, two days from that day, they're gonna be like, Oh yeah, I do know this photographer. He gave me his Instagram. Um, oh God, I can't remember what it was. What it was his Instagram? Oh jeez. And then they go to Google and search photographer. Every time. Okay, so just common sense with all this stuff. And I'll save you the $500 cost for the make $10,000 in one day. <laughs> anyway. And the other part of this, the secret is you actually have to sell prints or albums or whatever. Now, you know, like showing photos on a website uh, after you shoot them, you know, takes the, the, the puff out of this. You know, if you're really serious about making money in photography and, and making money as a studio photographer or an event photographer, something like that, you know, they have to be present in photos so you can sell them. You know, that's where money comes from in this industry. If you're not willing to do that, it's, again, forget the courses because that's all they're gonna tell you, you know. Um, and the secret magic thing that they say to post, you know, they have the words to use and it'll bring you $10,000 in portrait business in a day. It just, let's be realistic, you know, just be smart. It does, it's not going to work. But anyway, I just gave you the whole secret to success. So, you know, send me my $129. <laughs> Otherwise, just get out there and work. I'm sorry for the long ramble. Uh, but I just had to get this out there because I'm so sick of seeing these programs come across the, the, the waves saying, I can make you $10,000 in a day and just buy my program. It's another get rich quick scheme that they're following with everything else. And for some reason, photographers are more gullible than most. Have a great day.